students so now we want to figure out how to use this same scale but with liquids so what we just did was solids sand is a solid so we're doing the we just finished the mass of the solid now what if we have a liquid well liquid we can't just get out a whey paper put it on and then put the liquid on there you know it doesn't work so here's where we have to do a different method we actually there's two things that we can do here we can just hit the, put the beaker on, and then again, I'm gonna show you two methods here. Put the beaker on, hit the zero button. Now it doesn't weigh anything, just like last time. And then put the liquid in. Oops, I got some on the scale. Maybe I wanna know how much that liquid mass is in there. Um, I'm just gonna write that down. So that's 14.07 grams, so the mass, of the liquid water, that's all that was, was 14 point, let's look back, 14.06 grams. And again, this is the uncertain digit, right? So the last number you always write, even if it goes up and down, maybe it changed a little bit, write down the one that stayed on the most. It's still stuck on 14.06, so that's what it is, okay? All right, so now the other thing is what happens if your tear button doesn't work or you're using a scale that doesn't have a zero or a tear button? How do I measure the mass of the liquid? Well, for this situation, we're just gonna measure the mass of the beaker. So you're gonna write that down. It's gonna have to do some basic math here. So that's 49.70 grams is the mass of the, you always want to be detailed in your lab notebook, mass of the empty beaker, okay? So that's the empty beaker. Now we're going to add some liquid and watch the mass go up, right? Wow. And then I need to know, well, how much is the mass of that liquid, not the mass, because this right here is the mass of the beaker plus the liquid inside of it, okay? So let's go ahead and write that down. So it's, I'm gonna put it up here on top so I can do the easy subtraction. 65.67 grams is my mass of beaker plus the liquid water, okay? So if my question is, how many grams of just water, what do I have to do? This is just basic subtraction from when you guys were little, you know, elementary school. So you're just gonna subtract seven and 16 minus seven is nine. So that becomes five and one. So I'm just doing my basic math here. 65.67 grams minus my 49.70 grams means that the 15.97 grams is the liquid water that I just added. Um, and so sometimes it's a beaker that you're trying to, you know, deal with. Sometimes it's actual other object that you're trying to neglect the mass of that. But, you know, just using those, think about it. Think about what has mass and then how it's changing when you're doing your subtractions. So this should help you guys figure out um, the different ways that we use the digital scales, okay? All right.